Do you know where to check for the buyback list and the qualification list? I don't. Where do I check? Let's go. All right. So I saw two lists and one said qualifier and one said buyback. What does that mean? All right, the first list is qualifiers. Qualifiers automatically get to go to Viking Voyage for this quarter because they met the criteria. 3.0 GPA, zero office referrals, and 95% attendance. If you're not on the qualifier list, you're on the buyback list. I'm on the buyback list. So that means either you had like an office detention or you missed too many days of school to qualify. You fell below 95%. How to fix that is to use your Viking vouchers. I've got tons of these because I'm a very nice student. You are a good student. So beside your name, there is a number. It's either going to say 10, 20, 30, 25, whatever. That's how many Viking vouchers you have to give to one of your teachers. Which teacher? If you're in sixth grade, you do buybacks with Mrs. Robinson. Mrs. Robinson in sixth grade. If you're in seventh grade, you buy back with Miss Sheely. Seventh grade is Miss Sheely, but I'm in eighth grade, so who do I buy back with? Eighth grade buyback is Mr. Rowe. Mr. Rowe. Okay, so if I'm on the buyback list and it says 10, I have to give Mr. Rowe 10 of my Viking vouchers? Yes, because you're in eighth grade, you give Mr. Rowe 10 Viking vouchers. Can I pretend you're Mr. Rowe right now? Yes. Just to practice? Just to practice. Perfect. Then I will go and I will put you from buyback to qualified and you can go to the Viking voyage. And what's the Viking voyage for first quarter again? This quarter, we're going to go outside and play games. You can play kickball, or football, or soccer, or you can just be out there and you can have your phone and do whatever you want on your phone. Social time. I like being outside because the leaves are really pretty in October. They are. Awesome. So once I give all of these to Mr. Rowe, I qualify and I can go? Yes. Yay! Who do I go to if I have more questions? Because I get confused. If you have more questions, any of your team teachers can help you, and they will email me. But don't come down and ask me, because if 814 students come to my AVID classroom, the room would explode. That would be terrible. That would be, that would be funny, but terrible. Don't forget, students, make sure you check the qualified or buyback list. Every year I have a student think they qualify and they never checked. And once we get to the day of our event, which is November 8th, if you didn't check and you come ask me later, you're not going to be able to attend. Don't forget, everybody check. Check the list.